The primary focus of the app is the top recommended players that displays five players the software is recommending for you at this point in the draft. Based on projected fantasy points for available players, your roster needs, players you've already drafted, your draft position and league size, as well as average draft position results for each player based on completed drafts. This section provides summary stats to help you easily compare the recommended players, including their projected fantasy points, average draft position, tier within their position, bye week, total projected touchdowns and yards for this year, as well as last year's actual stats and their three-year career average stats. The software also displays the value-based drafting values based on your start starting roster requirements, as well as the dynamic value-based drafting values based on players expected to be drafted in the next two rounds. Player rankings are customized to your scoring rules and grouped and colored by position. Each player tile displays the player's projected fantasy points, value-based drafting value, positional tier, and bye week. You can also set the app to display the dynamic value-based drafting values from the options in the Draft Tools menu. Your roster summary displays the number of starters and bench players you have drafted at each position, followed by the start and bench roster requirements for each position. This helps you keep track of your roster needs without having to bring up the roster's pop-up. The tier summary always displays the next three tiers, including how many players remain available in each tier out of the total number of players included in that tier. Tiers are groupings of similarly valued players based on projected point values and help you determine the scarcity of top players available at each position. If there are seven, several players available in a tier, you may be able to wait on that position and still get similar value with your next draft pick. Click any player tile to bring up the player details view for that player. The player details view includes all the info you need to evaluate a player on draft day, including an interactive chart displaying each player's historical fantasy points by week based on standard CBS scoring rules for the past five years. You can click and drag to zoom any time period. View the remaining draft value for the top players at each position in this pie chart to make sure you're drafting the right position. You can visually compare players at the same position with similar average draft positions to see if you can get a similarly valued player later on in the draft. You can also compare key projected stats with last year's stats and their three-year career averages. And view a qualitative season outlook and review of last year for that player. To test the draft analyzer software and prepare for your draft, you can easily and quickly run mock drafts. When you are on the clock, draft a player, and then go to the draft tools menu and click mock draft until my next pick. The mock draft engine will make a draft pick for each owner until you are on the clock again. Draft selections made for other owners are based on each owner's remaining roster needs as well as player's average draft positions. The draft analyzer highlights the drafted player in orange and updates all of the analytics and rosters after each draft pick. An advanced feature of the draft analyzer web is the ability to shade the coloring of the positional tiers to visually identify where the drops in value occur and how many players remain in each tier. As expected, the difference in value of players gets smaller as the draft progresses and you get towards the bottom of the rankings. You can toggle this feature on or off from the draft tools menu. You can also view a very cool interactive chart for the top available players. Players are listed in order of their average draft position and display their fantasy points and draft value. Your remaining draft pick slots are designated with an orange dotted line, making it easier to see which players should be available with each of your remaining draft picks. When we're ready to start our real draft, we can go to Draft Tools and remove all draft picks to clear out that mock draft. To manually enter draft picks, simply click on the Draft Player button within each player tile. That player will be drafted for the owner that's on the clock. All rosters will be updated, and all of the analytics used throughout the app will be updated. You can also scroll down and draft players from the player ranking section, or even click on their player details and draft them from the player detail pop-up.